So I visited Boston recently to hang out with the other nerdy boys, the other co-hosts for the Nerdy Things podcast, and the whole first day pretty much was me getting driven around by Tim, flights and all that stuff, and then going to visit their store, which is Jordan's, one of the biggest furniture stores over there in Boston, and Beantown, which I did not know what to expect, and it was pretty interesting. I also got to see where the nerdy boys spent most of their time when they're away from the nerdy things they love, and of course, the IMAX, which was a fantastic experience. So, do you see what do you see this? Are you seeing this? The guy said this was like an intense IMAX theater, and I didn't believe them. It's huge. Day two here in. Boston hanging out with the guys. I slept really well last night in this, uh, uh, I'm here in Kevin's house and today's when all the content is pretty much gonna be produced. We're gonna do a ton of stuff today so yeah I'm probably gonna show you some of that and uh, let you see all that good stuff and I just woke up so that's why my hair and I'm all a little like that so yeah um, let's just see what happens today. Like past Jules said, today was the day that we're going to do most of the content making, making videos, audio, recording a live podcast, video and audio as well. And this was the Kingsman episode. So of course, we have to crack open a bottle of Old Forester Statesman in honor of the movie that just came out. And it was pretty fantastic, might I say. It tasted really good and we had it for the whole podcast. Here's some behind the scenes stuff on how we set it up and how we got it together, how we got this going all in one room for the very first time. Let's record Nerdy Things Podcast all together for the first time. You gotta remember, when you drink the bourbon, you have to keep the pinky up. Right, Tim? I don't think so. So the podcast went great, and like I said, we cracked open a bottle of Statesman bourbon, and one of the nerdy boys drank a little too much, and it got pretty funny. Can you guess which one of us drank a little too much, got a little too much fun in their system? I'll give you a few moments to guess. Either Kevin, Jules, or Tim. Ready? Here it is. Well, the next 20 Hard minutes? Cut to 20 minutes later. Yeah. <clears throat> Jules the human. It's this Massachusetts. This is the worst. Cannot. If I can get control of myself by then, and the blue moon then comes till 2018, and I don't get drunk again like this till 2018, everything's fine. But if Jenny sees me like this, or if Kevin posts shit like this about me online, then things are very bad. Yeah, Kevin will never post anything about you. Kevin's a good guy. I've known Kevin good. for like four years, Not and I do guy. trust him. He has a little bit of a side of him where he's like, eh, I don't want to cause trouble. But for the most part, he's a good dude. So I trust him. Okay, cool. And Glad you, Jules, trust. I trust you. Well. Like, if you're Instagramming this shit right now, this would be very bad for me as a human. And since you are Jules the human, I don't think you'd want to post this and make Tim the human look bad. No, never. Good. Thank you so much for watching the video. Make sure to subscribe. I have a goal of getting to 100 subscribers by the end of the year. Help me out and let me get to this goal. I would appreciate it so much. If you want to see that drunk podcast, there's going to be a link in the description of this video so you can watch that. Thanks, and I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs>